Hey guys, Shady Like a Tree here, and welcome into Reminiscing with Shady episode 94. This is Hooters Road Trip. Now, before I get into the game or talking about my experiences with this game, uh, I'm just going to say for those of you who aren't American, that Hooters is a American restaurant that primarily sells wings and finger food, sandwiches and the like. Uh, it is known for its um, busty waitresses who wear very low-cut and tight tank tops. Um, as well as their very short and yellow skirts. If you search Google Hooters, you'll come up with the links. I'm not going to provide you with any of that fodder. You're on your own for that. Uh, this game is widely considered to be one of the worst games ever in all time. Uh, as you can see why, I am literally all over the road. Uh, and then some. Uh, it's constantly given threes and twos out of ten. Uh, it's Metacritic rating on PlayStation is 30 out of 100, just to give you an FYI of how bad people consider this game to be. I don't particularly like this game, uh, but this is one of the last games to come out for the Sony PlayStation. Uh, I felt it was noteworthy on that front, and I also felt it was noteworthy because it's Hooters, um, and a lot of people like Hooters for that very reason. Uh, basically I saw this game on the shelf and I'm like, Hey, I wanted a racing game and it's got Hooters, which that means it's got hot girls. So why not hot girls racing game? I was, I don't know, 13 or whatever at the time. I think this game is rated E for everyone. Uh, oh, and by the way, it was developed by, uh, Hoplite research published by Ubisoft of all companies, uh, not released on any other platform other than the original PlayStation. Uh, it was released March 25th, 2002. Uh, basically, the idea or goal of the game is you're supposed to uh, drive from city to city in the given time limit um, and, uh, you know, not be absolutely slow or whatever. And it kind of gives you a guide on how far along you are in those things. Um, but, yeah, it's just really kind of awful. The best part about this game are the cutscenes after you finish a race um, where the girl from whatever city you've just made it to says, Howdy, y'all. Welcome to Georgia. Or, Howdy, y'all. Welcome to Florida. Or whatever they say. Um... Uh, and it was it's built it was basically promotional material for the for the restaurant chain um i believe the restaurant chain might have sold it um although i can't find any sources on that i do think i remember seeing my friends talk about going there and then buying this game and not ever liking it and i never liked it but it was 99 cents at the store and i thought hey for the one of the worst playstation games of all time but something that's notable that i can talk about uh i thought i might share this with you even though it's just god awful uh the scenery doesn't really change a whole lot the controls are just 10 sheep bad they're bad um and you just have to dodge the oncoming and cars you're trying to pass um as you get to the end That was uh, an example of what I was talking about, about the girls welcome you, or I should say women, they're not girls, they're young women, welcoming you to um, this city in this game. And uh, really this game is just awful. As you can see here, I'm again struggling to control the game, uh, or control my car uh, in this game. And uh, it, So... In order to keep you sticking around and interested in this game, as the physics, again, you just saw are terrible, uh, there will be another one of those cutscenes at the end, at the end if that's something you're interested in. If not, uh, just continue to watch me struggle to drive this car. Really, there isn't a whole lot notable about this game other than, again, it's often listed as one of the worst games of all time. Uh, but there is a fun little story that my friends and I have from when we first got, from when a friend of mine first got this game. Uh, you know, little childish, you know, 13, 14 year old us at the time, ooh, boobies or whatever, you know, this is, this is really, you know, the internet had been kind of around, but not as, it, it wasn't high speed back then, and, uh, video and, and things like that weren't, uh, as easily accessible and as, uh, high quality as it is today in, in 2015, you know, we're talking, uh, we're talking 13, 14 years ago now, uh, and he bought the game and he's like, look, I got this game and it's got boobies in it. And everyone was like, really? Wow. And so every he had invited like tons of people over to play this game. And again, it's an awful game just so they could get to the end of the level and see the pretty little Hooter girls um, who were happened to be at the end of uh, end of each race and the end of each level. But that's one story that uh, and this is one game that, you know, it'll just stick in my mind because it, it really kind of hammers home the fact that, you know, sex sells and, and 
it's really easy to package a crappy game when there's boobs involved. Um, and thankfully there weren't any more, to my knowledge, games made like this. I'm sure there are, but I don't know of any. Um, uh, I don't think Hooters may, has made any other games. Uh, I will say this, though, about Hooters. They do make pretty good sandwiches. Um, uh, I had been driving all night one night when I was, I don't know, maybe 20, and there was there were two options. The options were uh, I could eat at a Taco Bell or I could eat at a Hooters. They were right across the street from each other. And to be honest, I didn't want Montezuma's revenge from the Taco Bell. So I went to Hooters, and I got a pretty great burger, and I basically didn't pay the waitress no mind. And, uh, you know, sure enough... Uh, you know, a half hour, 45 minutes later, I'd eaten and I was back on the road again, none the wiser. And it was a, it was a decent sandwich, I got to say. Uh, I'm not really a wing guy, but, uh, it, you know, it was still good. But anyway, that story is for another day. Uh, anyway, guys, I want to thank you very much uh, for watching this episode of Reminiscing with Shady. This has been episode 94. This is Hooters Road Trip. We're nearing the end. You guys are going to hear the girls uh, tell me how we did. Um, but yeah, if you like this video, let me know, and uh, I will certainly see you next time. Thanks again for watching. Hi, y'all. Welcome to Georgia. How are you doing, sugar? Woo! You came in second place.